Go today and get your very own Maybe I'm Amazed merchandise. Get it in the shop at Maybe I'm Amazed Tribute.com. Hey everybody, CPO and Corey Clark from Maybe I'm Amazed. Back with another song, another track from the Russian album by Paul McCartney. It's the covers album. It's all these old covers that we love. We actually love this stuff. I mean, what's not to love? This yeah. is some this is some rootsy goodness. Yeah. Actually, Americana right yeah. here. Exactly. So uh, today we're going to be checking out Loudy Miss Cloudy. So uh, is every song like an American old school classic? Well, I don't know. I haven't looked. We haven't got that far yet. Yeah. Okay. We're only at Loudy Miss Cloudy. Getting ahead of myself. Well, right. That's why. Or if you're from the South, you might say Loudy Miss Cloudy. I think that's how you're supposed to say it. Loudy Miss Cloudy. Loudy. Loudy. Good Lord. There's like a W in there, I think. Yeah. yeah. There, there's two. There's a, there's a W in Loudy. Loudy as well. Loudy. All right, here we go. Here we go. Oh, piano. Song, I feel like yeah man the, cool yeah drums and bass feel yeah, good yeah bass too yeah guitar was killer too I yeah. mean the whole time especially since this sounds just like the last three songs like it's the same mix the same yeah they just went right right into it you know? right like they're just jamming but you could tell like they're in the same room and this dude's playing all these guitar solos and Paul's right there and Paul's like hey yeah he's like egging them on which like I can just put myself in that that's what I see I yeah see. that's what dude, it sounds like can you like. imagine like playing this with Paul and he's like Egging you on, you're like, jeez, yeah. I'm, you know, trying not yeah. to, because that reminds me of something Lawrence was telling us. We were asking him all these questions in the rehearsals and stuff, and 
talking about making back to the egg record and there was i can't remember what song it was but there's a really fast solo that he does on like he does these fast runs you yeah. know and we were asking about that and, and like how where that came from whatever and he's like well i was doing it and paul was sitting right next to me the entire time yeah. so I'm like dude the amount of pressure you know yeah. paul mccartney sitting next to you while you're playing a guitar solo and, rec and recording which is already nervous you know yeah nerve-wracking enough um, but that's I just feel that this just looks I can see it I can see the room you know? yeah I can see the guys like in the room playing together it's cool totally this is jamming yeah and this this song it, it feels good you know I mean it's yeah it feels great I, I, I feel like there's not much you know like after after we get through a couple of songs here I'm like I'm like we're we're gonna say the same thing about the Sonics like the whole record because they're it feels it, all like this, basically and, the same thing yeah. every song right but it's but it's different you know these different tracks are cool um i think i think i have heard this this song before mm -hmm. um this is all in that like yeah eddie cochran but like it's this is more of like that memphis vibe like mm, right and you're or like uh yeah like beale street have you ever been to beale street mm -hmm. once once we actually played i got to play at there's like a, a performing arts center at the top top of peel of oh, nice. street we did we did a gig there a couple of years ago and um but we you know we played we played around in and around memphis a couple of times and mm -hmm. that's i always love going to that place i think it's it's got you know it's yeah. it's it doesn't have the vibe that it did probably 20 30 years ago or 50 years ago yeah. for that matter but but it's still you know there's still something there's something in the air totally. there yeah it's like an energy so yeah. Um, I wonder if well they they're probably not recording this in Memphis, are they? I don't think so. I, I, yeah. Did I we, did we you find out where before tomorrow we're gonna find out where they're tracking all this stuff. Um, but I'm sure you guys know. So maybe let us know in the comments too. Um, uh, so Lottie Miss Claudie, which overall this is a great song. It's, it's fun. Probably my oh, favorite one oh. yet. There was one thing that I noticed too was that um, every time it would do that build, mm -hmm. it would it would resolve on the one. What do you mean? Did you notice that? Like it would come like instead of going to the five, the five which chord? which you know most twelve bar blues songs uh, okay. tend to do. They're like da da da. Like it was like da da da. It, like it went to the one. I thought it went to the, the five. It was just a lower. It just went down, dropped down lower. M maybe it did, and maybe uh, maybe I'm. Yeah. ridiculous maybe you're amazed maybe i'm amazed yeah that's <laughs> true no but i i swear it went it went to the one and i was like what that's that's weird how it's resolving like that mm. but in it an interesting little uh a little tidbit of of 12 bar bluesness that was unusual to me loudy loudy miss cloudy so anyways good. felt good felt make great. sure you guys leave some yeah. comments down there definitely blow us up uh if we're getting this stuff wrong but um you know, it's our first time hearing it. Be nice. It's our reaction. We don't know what we're doing. We're just it's here. It's reaction. We're just here just listening to headphones and we're just stuff. here. But this is a nice little break, I think. At least for me. Well, what do you think? Yeah, I mean, you mean compared to the other records? Yeah. Yeah, because Paul's records are dense, you know? Yeah. It's like, it's actually, sometimes it's hard to do this, to like, know that you're being filmed and listen and pay attention. Yeah. Because there's so much going on. There's like the production, there's the songwriting, there's just Paul being yeah. cool. This one's a little more straightforward. It's yeah. Just like straight up old blues tunes and, yeah and you just get to hear the band having fun again it's a palate cleanse yeah it's yeah. just like let's okay let's let's cleanse it all out and let's start start anew yeah start, start afresh. fresh yeah so i'm i'm actually as we're going through this i'm like okay now i'm interested now i'm like are you excited. feeling cleansed is your palate yeah i'm cleansed? getting cleansed yes <laughs> i'm for the next record i'm excited for the next record yeah so, there you go. All right, tomorrow we're going to be checking out. What are we checking out? What does that say, Corey? Bring it. Bring it on home to me. Bring it on home Sam to me. Sam Cooke. Oh, Love yeah. This, song. I, this is great. This is one of my favorite Sam Cooke tunes. Okay, this this is going to be hard because this is hard to beat. Yeah. I mean, it's Sam yeah, Cooke. You're not going to beat the original. McCartney, maybe, maybe McCartney has a shot at it. Yeah, for sure. I'm just hoping he goes a different direction with it. Yeah, something absolutely. Different. Yeah, you can't you can't try to tune in next cook. week. <laughs> we can't get ahead of ourselves. Okay, this is later. Okay. Okay. So tomorrow, we're gonna find out how this compares to the Sam Cooke version. Yeah. 
Um, make sure you guys come back for that. Make sure you like this video, subscribe to the channel, and turn on the notification, the notification bell so you'll know when we're coming out with the next video. Just like always, everybody, peace and love.